Beach here from thesonicstate.com. I'm at NAMM 2015, feeling very relaxed and mellow thanks to the playing of Brian Keogh from Jim Dunlop. I'm also with Bob Cedro from Jim Dunlop, and we're about to look at the new way huge pedals. Uh, so, we'll start just about here, which means I'm going to have to slightly get out of the way for the cameraman. And uh, Bob, can you talk us through what we're looking at? Sure. Right now, uh, my buddy Brian is playing through the Blue Hippo, it's a chorus. And George from Way Huge, uh, Master Guru, found some old stock of uh, Bucket Brigades. So we're putting out a limited edition and hopefully maybe scour the earth for more. <laughs> when he say found, he was just kind of, you know, in his workshop one day, stumbled across a drawer. Well, you know, I can't tell you the details, but it was a happy phone call, to say the least. So, you know, these things, the analog, digital, you know, they both have their place, but the analog chorus is something about it. It's very natural, very wide, um, uh, lush, dark, deep. But the, what he did is he kept the pro uh, processing very simple and straightforward, like the very old school. So there's not, not a lot between the guitar and your amp. So, you know, a little bit of filtering, the, the delay, a little bit of alpha filtering, and that's pretty much it, you know. Now, the cool thing about the Blue Hippo is because of that simple uh, uh, topology, really it's lush, very analog, it just drifts away as natural as it can be. Very simple control, speed, control the rate of modulation, the depth of modulation, how much it's going to move around, change the pitch. The other thing, simple switch for chorus mode, and vibrato mode to give this just now you're hearing the pitch move. Very straightforward, very lush. And this is a street, and you're going to find this for a 169.99 on the streets. True hardwire bypass, fantastic uh, casing of uh, aluminum, uh, and also a little form, smaller form factor than the older uh, Way Huge products. So it's a little pedal board friendly. Moving to the uh, Saucy Box. Saucy box is very great name. It is, isn't it? You guys would uh, really appreciate that. Um, once again, you know, simplicity is going for uh, utilitarian, but simplicity. But instead of putting two knobs to kind of mix, like what a lot of the bass guys do, they mix the dry with the wet. Yeah. Well, we do that, supply two knobs. And here, for guitar players, we made it a little more simple. Plus, we, we picked all the sweet spots as how much dry and how much wet should be in um, at different points of the uh, gain. So, this drive circuit actually does all the work for you. It does all the mixing together. So, if I put this on, I'm going to back it down. Very transparent. Looks like I just put a little dirt on this guitar. Sound exactly the same. Now, raise it. trained you know <laughs> yeah he cleans up well too <laughs> 129.99 street true hardwire bypass and real simple single uh, passive tone control and then up obviously i'll put on you know new for 2015 actually george has been very busy this year <laughs> we've been feeding him but we, we've been not letting him out because moving to the saffron squeeze saffron squeeze it's a uh, compressor as one would expect but George, once again, wanted to make it uh, very utilitarian and very versatile. So he brought out some very um, straightforward, yet very uh, 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 powerful controls. And one being the gain, the other being the tone. So you can actually have a tone on your, uh, on your compressor. You can go from real snappy, chicken bacon, very percussive, to more of like a, a, a jazzy, a chordal, tone and also then the attack very important the attack when dialed down very slow attack will actually squash the next note coming or the next chord yep. when you when you have a fast attack it actually 
will bring out the next note so that it can be very transparent. Almost the player knows it's on, but the audience won't. Yeah, sure. So I'll just play it right now, or Brian will play it <laughs> straight up. Also the gain, if I back the gain down, now it's not going to have as much signal to want to squash. So it's much more transparent. If I bring it all the way up, now it's like the compressor that I'm ready to play. Simple again, but it's so versatile. And this is um, going to uh, be found on the streets for about $139.99. Okay. And that's everything from Way Huge for 2015 so far. Yeah, so far you never know. Yeah. 20, 2015 just started. <laughs> Uh, you got to keep feeding George that's the only thing. Ah, uh, you know, and maybe we'll let him off some fresh air, get some new ideas. Yeah. Um, so, uh, and we do have other videos from Jim Dunlop Brands at NAM2015. You can see them at sonicstate.com forward slash amped. Uh, Brian, Bob, thank you very much. Thank you for stopping by.